Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dan here. It's time for another episode of First Bite. We are in Ybor City and I am reviewing a place right across the street from where I'm standing now. There it is. Sunday's Delicatessen. I've been here before. I reviewed it on my Facebook page when I was just doing First Bite on Facebook. Now I got the YouTube channel. As you know, I've gone back and reviewed a lot of other places. I'm doing this one. Time to give it a proper review and a proper score. I've already got my takeout. Harley was loud. Anyway, yeah, let's go. Time to do this. Sunday's Delicatessen is located in Ybor City, 1930 East 7th Avenue, Tampa, Florida, 33605. All right, we are back in the office. It is just that kind of day. It's cool outside. I wouldn't say it's cold. It's bordering on cold. It's Christmas Eve. Of course, you're going to see this long after Christmas Eve, but I'm filming this on Christmas Eve. It's just a dreary gray sweatpants and hoodie kind of day. And a good sandwich makes it all better. Now, my dad and I actually ate lunch here. We were just had, we had some time to kill today. We hadn't eaten. We just went out and grabbed some lunch. He got a chicken pesto sandwich, I think. I got a barbecue meatloaf sandwich. Everything at this place. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. I think I took a picture of my sandwich that I got for lunch. I think I took a picture of the menu board, too. A couple pictures real quick. Yeah, I told you. Looked really good. Looked absolutely fantastic. What I have here is the Buccaneer sandwich. Tell me that doesn't look fantastic. The Buccaneer is the sandwich that I reviewed on my Facebook page, along with an Italian sandwich, I think. Back, as I said, before I was formally doing First Bite. Now it's time to give it a real review. The Buccaneer consists of Black Forest ham, chicken, pepperoni, melted Munster cheese, sweet peppers, spicy mayo on a toasted baguette. I love this deli. I love this deli. Seven days a week, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Sunday, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Everything blends together so good. You know, it's fitting. We have a sandwich called the Buccaneer that's actually good. Because we have a football team here called the Buccaneers that is not very good. So we need a good Buccaneer sandwich to balance out a bad Buccaneer football team. Also, you know... As I've said before, this has nothing to do with Sunday's Delicatessen. Just a little side thing where, as I run across a cool root beer, I like to try it. I love good craft root beer. I actually have some Sioux City Birch Beer. That looks pretty cool. It's not root beer technically, it's birch beer, but, and I'm not going to explain all the differences. You can look up the difference between root beer and birch beer and sarsaparilla, but I've got Sioux City birch beer. Mmm. Look at the color on it, too, just a little bit different. It acts like it wants to be strong and bite you right up front. And then it gives way to a nice creaminess. Almost the same creaminess and texture that your mouth is cream soda, but without the cream soda flavor. It's birch beer flavor. I like this. That's one of my favorite drinks ever. Like in terms of, I don't know, that's that's a 9.4. That's, that's a great score, strong score for that root beer, birch beer. That's fantastic. Anyway, back to the sandwich. So I've had like... Four different sandwiches from this place. I have little sides too. Like a little, um, you can get coleslaw, potato salad, or whatever from their cold case. 
anything you want, sandwich-wise. This place is fantastic. This sandwich is no exception. Man, I wanted this to be good. Because sometimes you go someplace and you're like, is it just a fluke that I get a good sandwich? You go back again, eh, maybe I was just really hungry that day. No, not a fluke. I mean, anything I've tried so far in their restaurant, anything I've tried, I could probably put in the eights, score-wise. Now, I scored a sandwich in the not-too-distant past, an 8.4, I believe, from a place around the corner from me. That was kind of my own creation. It was my own twist on their menu. It wasn't something that was actually on their menu. I modified it. Can I give this the same score as that? Because I like the sandwich I created at the other place. I like this for two different reasons. Can I give them both the same score? I gave the other one an 8.4. I think this place is better. It is. And keep in mind, I didn't have to modify this either. I got something off the menu as it was. Exactly the way that it comes. Exactly the way it was created. And it's perfect. Everything I've had there is perfect. 8.6. <laughs> That's a good Buccaneer sandwich score. Great meal. What a wonderful Christmas Eve. Great sandwich. And they do have hot sandwiches and press sandwiches, and they have cold sandwiches as well. Just take a look at their menu board. They have specials. They have everything. Just go here. I'm going to shut up now. I'm going to shut up and enjoy the weather. I'm going to go sit out on my back patio, take the rest of my sandwich and the rest of my birch beer, get a fire in the fire pit, and enjoy the cool weather and my time off from my real job which is not making YouTube videos, unfortunately. And that's it. Get here. Check this out. Um, I think you're going to like this. Anyway, that's it. Deuces. Dan is gone. That has been another episode of First Bite.